Hey guys, it's Andrew from Anything Nootropics. Today I'm going to be covering uh, nootropics and studying. So, you know, some effective stacks you can use when you're studying. Uh, and this one compound that I've um, been looking into recently, which can really, really impress you with how much it can help you study. It's incredible. Uh, so there's two ways we can attack the problem of extra focus and alertness for studying. So if you have a big test, an exam, whatever. Uh, the first thing, also a common compound, which can really knock your studying up a notch, like I mentioned earlier. Uh, the next is like a potentially safer but less effective solution, more of like a nootropic stack that uses uh, safer nootropics that I'll mention later to um, achieve the same but not quite as effective effects. Uh, so you've absolutely heard of Adderall before. It's like your typical university college students go to focus drug for cramming before a big test, supposedly. And I want to introduce you to a compound which you may not have heard of, modafinil. So it's an up-and-coming wonder drug. It's what the NZT drug from Limitless was based on. Uh, and it can act in your brain in multiple ways to give you an incredible, calm, clean focus, which can last for up to 16 hours. It's also not addictive, and if you follow my advice and don't try to buy generics from disreputable online dealers, like ModUp or ModAlert or Provigil or whatever, it can be added incredibly cheaply. Uh, so first, an introduction to Modafil, Modafinil. Sorry. It works on multiple brain processes simultaneously in order to produce a very clean sense of focus. The result for you, a very natural, peaceful sense of being alert, and very awake. It's almost like being present. Uh, it basically tricks the receptors in the brain uh, which tell you how alert you are into working harder which increases alertness. It also affects your dopamine levels making you feel happier. So it's awesome. It's illegal. Uh, Modafinil is a controlled drug in Canada and the US and it can only be had with a doctor's prescription. But there's an alternative. Uh, a Durafinil. Uh, it's converted into Modafinil in the liver. Uh, but and the advantage to you is that a drafinil is illegal. In fact, it's dirt cheap. It can be had from almost any online nootropic supplier. Powder City is my favorite one. You can actually get it for 15 bucks for 5 grams. Now, a typical dose is like 100 to 300 milligrams, depending on your body weight. And that's a month's supply if taken every day. Disclaimer, don't do that. You should be cycling it and taking it at most like 2-3 times a week. And that means that that 5 grams is easily a 2 month supply. For 15 bucks and it's incredible just try it trust me uh, but if you're skeptical about the benefits you don't trust the fact that if it's dosed way too highly or taken every day for a lot of months it can have some negative effects in the liver um, unlike most nootropics it's kind of one of those half and half ones I mentioned uh, then I have a nootropic stack below it I've been playing with for a while that can be taken every day to improve your brain's long-term health and in the short term it can also kick your brain up to a higher gear to help give you some extra energy and focus uh, so the stack consists of 100 milligrams of L-theanine and 50 milligrams of caffeine. Uh, the proven ratio for L-theanine and caffeine is about 2 to 1. And I found that that's kind of the optimal level for me to get like extra focus, extra alertness, but not really experience like a jitter or the crash or anything. Uh, 200 micrograms of herpes, uh, huperzine A. Uh, it's just, it improves the long-term function of your health and it kind of gives you like a nice calm, cool feeling I find. It's really, really cheap too, so it's kind of a nice add to any compound, especially this one. Uh, 10 milligrams of Vinpocatine. It's actually a good long-term one to take. It improves the blood flow to your brain. And as you know from any other body parts, uh, any extra blood you can get into it makes it function more effectively and makes it stronger. So your brain will just function in the long-term better by taking Vinpocatine. Um, and then there's 150 milligrams of alpha-GPC, which is a good choline source. So if you take alpha-GPC, it potentiates the effect of everything else and takes away a lot of the side effects you might find, like headaches or nausea or anything. So it's a good to take with any stack, some choline source. And alpha-GPC is, in my opinion, the safest and the most effective one, but it's more expensive too, so it's kind of a trade-off. And then a hunt, and for me, 10 milligrams of Nupact, which is my favorite nootropic person. Yeah, I just fuck it. I love it. Uh, it just makes you feel really good. It takes away like that kind of surface level like negative thought anxiety anything you might have like that it just makes you feel really present calm cool happy productive it's a really nice thing to take and it's good for long-term health too but it, depending on your preferences you can also substitute that with anti race stem prami race stem or fire stem uh, now if you mix this hefty stack with some adrafinil too you're in for some real fun so powder city is my recommended supplier for both adrafinil and every other compound mentioned and uh you know have a good day cheers